Okay, everybody, it's everybody's favorite red mage, Nolfing Wayne, here with you with another uh, classy way of playing Magic the Gathering. Uh, today I'm here to break down certain red cards that I think, or all red cards, any red card that I think is cool. We're just going to talk about red cards because that's what it is. Welcome to the channel. If you're interested in seeing me play this game, I play for free, absolutely free, zero dollars. That's uh, twitch.com slash Wayne. So, last time we spoke, we were looking at Kissick Wolf Rider. It's one red mana for a 1 2, two creature types, human knight with menace. And for three, make a 3 2 wolf. That's cool. That's super cool. Uh, I was trying to find a comparison to this. Uh, there was really no other card that can probably deal with it that does what it does. Apart from Swift Spear getting bigger and the other, uh, you know, the other mage that gets bigger when you attack. Uh, oh, when you cast a spell. I forgot the name of that guy already. Let's look at this. Today we're going to talk about Flame Blessed Bolt. Is this the one I want to talk about? I, yeah, I, I, this is what we're going to talk about because I know there isn't like a, like a shock right here. This is the closest thing they're going to have. This is going to be used for draft, okay? Flame Blessed Bolt. I think the, the biggest reason why this card is going to see a lot of flavors because it's an instant. Uh, it does two damage to target creature or planeswalker. If that creature or planeswalker would die this turn, exile it instead. Now, I honestly felt that there was a missed opportunity here. This should have been a tribal vampire card. This card would make so much more sense if it said tribal instant vampire. Now, I have no idea why they're not doing no tribal instants. Someone can ring that up for me. Uh, that would be uh, super useful. But I think because there was a missed opportunity here, uh, this was a very lame card. This just follows every other dumb shock spell. Uh, you might as well make it a sorcery, right? Thanks. Thanks for wasting my time. Uh, this won't see a lot of standard play unless this is the only card you have. This might be kind of cool in, in limited. But they do have a braid. I don't know. Targeting a planeswalker, it should have done more. Or... It, Targeting a, a vampire should have done three. Like, there is so much missed opportunity in a lot of these cards. It's ridiculous. Right? It, it's so... Like, it feels like a waste. Right? Now, sure, you get to exile a creature. You get to exile a planeswalker. That's new. Right? I am for that. I like that. Okay? But a lot of missed opportunities. Should have been three damage to a vampire planeswalker. Should have been three damage to a certain planeswalker. Somebody that had a grudge to against red. Someone had a grudge against green, or like a Garouk or something. right? If, if it's a green Planeswalker, it does three instead. Missed opportunity. Tribal Planeswalker. Tribal. Instant Tribal Vampire. Missed opportunity. Okay. I think Flame Bless Bolt should be uh, not a top tier burn spell uh, in limited, but it's going to be splashable, which makes... Anyone playing against red be very careful on how they use their planeswalker abilities. Um, that being said, this does get rid of little dorks, uh, but you're most likely going to heavy double down on a braid. A braid's going to be the killer in the format, especially for cards uh, that are going to be pretty puny. Now, if we look at all the of these other red cards here, it pretty much hits every single card, like especially ones that look like they could do a thing, right? Uh, Flame Best, Blessed Bolt. Let me see, what else can we do? There's two damage to target creature. Or planeswalker, that creature Planeswalker would die. This turn, exile it. Uh, let me see if there's anything else that I would add to here. Um, let's go with... Hmm, I don't know. Uh, no, I think I got all my opinion out there. Uh, but yeah, that's that's what I'm thinking. I, I, I feel that this would have been fantastic if they would have done it that style. But if you have any other thoughts, you let me know. If you think that's a terrible idea on my part, please let me know. I'm, I, I, I am a red mage genius, but I can't always be right, okay? Let me know in the comments down below if you think that this should be something different or if you believe what I told you was... If, if you think my opinion is just trash, let me know in the comments down below. Thanks for sharing, uh, hopping along. This is uh, Nofing Way, also known, a.k.a. Spencer. You can hit me up on twitch.com slash Way for $0 uh, Magic Gathering for free. I play this game for absolutely free. If you don't know how to do it, I will show you how. Thanks again for tuning in. It's your boy Spencer, and I'll catch you later. See you next time. Peace.